Hello and welcome to my channel. So as you can obviously see and tell by the title, today's look is a pancake day look. I have been waiting to do this for such a long time now. I had this idea in my head and I was like, right, I need to do it. So I'm so happy I can finally show you all it. It is inspired by what I like on my pancakes. I like a few things. So we've got a few bits going on here. If you would like to see how I created this pancake day inspired makeup, up look then please keep watching so i start off by going into my laroc summer tones palette and go into the warm yellow eyeshadow in that palette and i blend that into my crease and also put a little bit over my lid as well i have already primed my eyes and done my base i then decided i want to make it into a bit of a spotlight eye so i got some concealer and applied that to the center of my eye and then blend it out with a small blending sponge and then i go over that middle section with a much brighter yellow from that same eyeshadow palette. I also do this on the bottom lash line as well. I then get my white Barry M eyeliner pencil and start to outline the drips on the other side of my face. So once I'm happy with the outline, I then go into my Urban Decay Electric palette and use that bright pink shade called Savage. And I apply this to the outer edge of this drawing that I've done. I try to leave the centre really, really light and almost clear in a way so you can see my skin through it but on the borders i try to keep it as opaque and pigmented as possible i then wanted to do a kind of a subtle look on my actual lid so i applied a really light pink eyeshadow on the lid and then in the crease just a little bit darker pink eyeshadow just to contour it and give it a little bit of definition I then outline the drips with a white face paint. The face paints I'm using in this tutorial are by Snazaroo and I have a palette and it is honestly one of my favourite things. I'll link it in the description down below. I start off using the red face paint and start to paint on some strawberries on my forehead. Then I go back to the other side of my face which is the lemon and sugar side. So I first off go into the yellow face paint and paint a lemon. I also go into a little bit of orange as well to just add the definition to the lemon wedge. I then go back to the other side of my face and alternate colours of the face paint and start to draw some sprinkles underneath that eye. Now it's time to paint on the sugar on the lemon and sugar eye. So it's just a white face paint and just tap in on that side of the face around the lemon to create some sugar. I then fill in the eyebrow on the syrup side of my face and I make it into a sprinkles eyebrow. So I start to draw different kind of sprinkles in the shape of my eyebrow. On my other eyebrow I decide just to paint it completely pink as I'm going to be wearing a pink wig. I then put on some mascara and some false eyelashes. They'll be linked in the description down below. I then put on my wig and I honestly think this is my most favourite wig that I own. And then I put on my headpiece what is literally a headband with some real pancakes glued to it with some hot glue gun over the top of it that I painted pink and also glued on some real strawberries. As the headpiece was quite heavy I had to use a thick headband for it to kind of balance on my head properly so what I did is get the hair of my wig and just pinned it around it so you couldn't really see the headband that much and lastly it's for the lips and I use the Huda Beauty liquid matte lipstick in the shade girl talk and then I top that with the Dior addict ultra gloss in pearl last time I wore this wig I said that I would show you how long it is so here it is I will do a video on all my wigs soon so this is the final look I really really hope you like it if you do hit the thumbs up button down below i hope you are having an amazing pancake day if you're in the uk like me let me know in the comments down below what you like on your pancakes i am very much a lemon and sugar or completely the other way with syrup and strawberries and sprinkles and everything so um 
I don't know what I'm going to be having today. If you would like to see more crazy and makeup looks like this, hit the subscribe button and that notification bell. I upload twice a week and this week we had a little bonus one because of Pancake Days. If you would like to see more close-up pictures of this makeup look and all my other ones and also some behind the scenes because I've been uploading to my Instagram stories while I was filming this, make sure you're following me on Instagram as well. My name is at brooke.ellis underscore. It'll be on the screen. It'll probably be on this side. But it'll also be linked in the description down below if you are interested. I'm so happy with how this turned out. I think this is one of my favourite looks I've done in a long time. And shout out to my mum for helping me make this because I was struggling. The struggle was real. But we are here. And they smell so nice and I want to eat them. But they're covered in glue so that's not a good idea. Thank you so so much for watching this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye. Bye.